friends uh, this is your govindraj uh, welcome to my channel uh, today we have a very uh, special situation which is uh, covid 19 which has become a global uh, epidemic and it is everyone's responsibility to behave uh, responsibly and uh, support everyone to come out of uh, this situation and meanwhile the government has directed uh, every private establishment to uh, you know shut down their operations until uh, 31st and also advised uh, the buyers to pay continue to pay wages for all its uh, employees and in this situation we all have, we all have to think that uh, how we can balance uh, the interests of the employees as well as uh, employers there are various uh, concerns which are there even though the government has said uh, to continue to pay the wages and take care of their employees it is always the question how uh, you know employer uh, can uh, continue to pay uh, if he has no capacity and meanwhile uh, you know it is the interests of also employees is uh, very important uh, if the employer is not going to take care how the employees can sustain are there any remedies or options available so i have tried to analyze uh, this situation with various uh, options and circumstances uh, let's look into those uh, scenarios this is not possible only to uh, you know explain all this in uh, one video i will try to put this in in uh, one or two parts and let's deliberate and uh, discuss uh, these issues so that uh, we can be prepared well uh, for the future which is uh, coming but i am not sure whether uh, this will be uh, only uh, you know a week affair or uh, um, maybe a two months or one month or you know it take it can take any amount of time and uh, definitely sure it's not going to go away within one week going at uh, experiences of different countries i am sure that it's going to take lot of time and uh, if at all if we behave very uh, responsibly probably we may have a situation that it gets over at least in the very near uh, future maybe 10 days or 15 days or months so so if we are not going to behave very uh, responsibly this can uh, take more uh, time and then it can also lead to a lot of issues to the government uh, employees and also the employers let's deliberate and discuss uh, certain uh, scenarios in this uh, situation friends so friends so now uh, this situation it is important for us to uh, you know think how can we balance both employers and uh, employees interests or i proceed i have a small uh, disclaimer the views and opinions expressed in this video are purely my personal opinions and views and this is my effort to find a balancing approach and to find alternatives and uh, it is not to take any sides uh, this is my small disclaimer before uh, we think of anything let's understand the need of the our friends it is everybody's responsibility to curtail the spread of epidemic uh, it is including employers employees government common public suppose if we don't uh, you know help or support in curtailing uh, the spread of uh, this epidemic we will lose our existence on the earth friends so that is why it is my sincere request to all of you please 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 behave uh, responsibly and uh, be at home and if possible uh, support uh, the government machinery and whoever is involved in the initiatives uh, support to the extent uh, possible now let's look into what are the interests and worries friends if you look at the employer definitely the employer uh, is worried at this point of time this questions he will definitely have what will i do at this point of time and what will happen to my uh, products produced and can i uh, continue to produce and supply if i cannot do it how can i generate the money how can i pay my suppliers and employees and overheads if i don't get the money and how long i can pay my employees how do i sustain my family and of course employers uh, family and how long i can sustain and will i sustain this situation he is also human being friends then he will also think that will i be alive to sustain this situation if an employer has got uh, reserves definitely he can be able to sustain for some time however in this uh, situation in in the business situation you know friends the money has to come money has to get generated and then only uh, the transactions and everything can be taken care so these are the employers uh, interests and worries let's look into employees worries also they are also not uh, indifferent employee is also thinking that what will i do will my employer continue to pay me even when i remain at home and he will also be definitely have this caution friends is my employment safe and what will i do if my employer don't pay me 
and how do i sustain my family and he will also definitely think how long i can sustain and will i sustain this situation considering this uh, uh, situation he will also have this fear in the mind will i be alive so this if you look at these are the interests and worries and which are you know uh, opposite of each other one way the employer is concerned about his uh, products and uh, also concerned about his family and also concerned about how he will generate the money how he will uh, uh, you know take care of his uh, responsibilities including uh, paying employees so it's look into what the government is saying in this situation the government is saying uh, or giving the advisory uh, to all the private establishment that uh, do not terminate the employees including contract and casuals do not reduce uh, wages if any employee takes leave the same should be treated as on duty if the place of employment is closed such period should be treated as on duty and sanction paid leaves uh, for the days of absence so this is what the government ad advisory is, uh, is talking about it well friends uh, we will keep uh, aside what the government is saying uh, for the moment uh, if you look at this situation it is a question of uh, survival of humanity if we survive or you know if everybody survives then only the business money everything therefore uh, it is everybody every employer's responsibility whether he is small medium big he should take care of their part and help their employees as long as possible and to best of their capacities well friends so we talked about uh, employer's responsibility what is government is saying everything what is after that friends how long it is going to continue what about beyond the employer's capacity is he going to do something about it employer's expenses taxes bills overheads are not going away friends can employer resume operations at this point of time and who is going to buy even if he is successful to produce what is the role of government to bail out this situation what are the strategic options available for employers to balance the situation and also what options employees have can employer invoke legal remedies including provisions of id act 1947 to safeguard uh, his interest these questions friends we will uh, deliberate uh, in the next video keep watching uh, my channel for uh, the updates and also deliberations on this uh, topic if you like it uh, don't forget to subscribe this channel friends my coordinates are provided in this video thank you very much friends and see you soon